What if? Hey, folks, what's going on? This is Wesley, Million Dollar Virgin, with another Ask a Multimillionaire episode with yours truly. And I got one question for you. What if? What if? And you might be thinking to yourself, what the hell am I talking about? But my question is this. What if it works out? You know, so many people I hear every single day, they say, Wesley, what if it goes wrong? What if I fail? What if I lose my money? What if I lose my marriage? What if I do the wrong thing? What if? Do you understand what if is the most powerful word or phrase in your success vocabulary? What, what if? Put me in the situation I am today. I'm a millionaire. Using what if properly put me, Wesley Virgin, on million dollar status here. Because I use the word what if to empower me. See, it's so easy to say what if it doesn't work, Wesley. And it's that voice in the back of our mind that keeps telling us, well, what if? What if it does what if it doesn't work? You know, what if I lose it all? What if what if I don't get the job or you know, what if I lose the house or what if I lose the car? What if what if But I think to myself, what if it works? What if you quit your job and everything from that step going forward works out in your favor? What if you leave that person that's negative in your life and everything works out? What if you start the business and that business makes you a millionaire? What if the next person that you talk to, the next person that you recruit is the person that will literally change your life? What if? The point is this. So many of us are so focused on the negative aspect of of the power of what if. Understand, the title of this freaking video is the powers of what if, which means this. What if can destroy you? What if can lead you down a path of negativity, pain, hurt, failure, sabotage? But what if can lead you down the road of prosperity, guys? What if made me a millionaire. <laughs> when I lost my vehicle, well, I said, you know what? What if I lost my vehicle for a reason to get a brand new vehicle and I bought myself a Mercedes G-Wagon? What if the time that I personally decided to leave my freaking job, I said, what if everything just works out? What if, what if I just get an opportunity, I get the business that's going to make me money beyond my job? <laughs> I remember the time when I was kicked out of my apartment. Well, what if, even though I'm sleeping on the floor at my friend's apartment, what if the next month, the next 30 days of my life is going to put me in a mansion or a condo where I can look over the ocean in Miami Beach? <laughs> Folks, all of you understand what I'm trying to tell you here tonight or today or this evening. Thanks for the likes and shares. What if it's either destroying your life today or it's building your life up? That's it. Because every event, every situation that happens to you in your life at that single moment you have a decision to make and the decision is this what does this mean to me what does this mean see if you got fired today your mind is asking you one question what does this mean does this mean that i didn't do a good job does this mean i'm going to lose everything does this mean that maybe i need to change my careers or does this mean that it's time for me to embrace my greatness 
Does this mean that the next job or the next opportunity is going to be the opportunity that's going to give me the abundance of money that I need? See, a lot of us, we pray for a lot of things. And then I believe that God or the universe gives it to you. Sometimes we're praying for the new job. We're praying for the new opportunity. We're praying for finances. And if we see something removed from our life, like a house, and we see that we have to file bankruptcy or we lose our job. We see that as failure. But that could be a blessing. Always remember this. When anytime something <laughs> seems to be negative that happens in your life. And the universe and God knows your desire. Which everybody's watching me. Everybody, God knows your desire. The universe knows what you want. But... You don't know how God or the universe is going to unveil the blessings. See, I see a lot of people that get upset when God or the universe or their decisions move things out of their life. Well, things are getting removed out of your life so new things can be placed in your life. Guys, you see this? I'm driving a Carvet. This is a beautiful Carvet Stingray, right? $75,000 wrapped. It has a beautiful engine on it. And 700 horsepower is loud as hell. I could not get this if I was still driving my 1988 Honda Accord. I could not get this if I was still driving my 1988 Lincoln Town Car. Things will be removed out of your life to make room for new things. But it's your responsibility to say, what if it works? What if the reason why all this stuff that's happening to me that appears with my physical eye to be negative, what if God of the universe, the universe is setting me up for greatness? He's setting me up for a blessing that's about to appear in my life. It's time to get excited. Yes. Woo. I just lost my job today. I'm excited. Yes. Because God is getting ready to set me up. For the desires. He's putting on a new path. Because he understands that 9 to 5 grind is not the path that I want. Man, I just lost my car. Oh, I just lost $10,000. Yes! Now God is making room for $100,000. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, what I'm trying to tell you is a multi-millionaire because I've been through the process. The process that you're going through right now, I have been through the process. Right now, I'm looking at my property here. It's over 10,000 square foot. It cost me $1 million just to buy the property. $5 million just to buy the freaking home. Okay? It's going to take maybe two, three years to build. And thank God I used the word what if in a positive direction. What if I'm here for a reason? What if you're watching this video for a reason? What if this video right now is the life-changing video that's going to help you get off your ass, stop feeling sorry about yourself, stop being in pity, stop bitching, stop whining, stop saying, oh, whoa, it's me, and get up and get to work. And get up. And start picturing and start visualizing your goals. You know, it's so hilarious. I'm already a millionaire, but yet I'm still doing the same dream building I did when I had $1,000 in my bank account. And I can't get people out there that message me every day to say, Wesley, I want more. Wesley, I want things to happen different in my life. Wesley, I want things to happen. And I'm a fucking millionaire. And I'm out here, I'm not making any excuses. I have things I got to do. I have eight businesses. I got to travel to China next week. I got to go shop. But I'm still, I have children to attend to. But I'm still out here dream building. And I'm already making millions of dollars. And I can get you to get off your ass. Get up every day. And get outside your house and go see something different. I can't you... I can't get you to use the word what if in a positive direction that even though it seems with the physical eye that something disastrous is happening in your life. And I can't get you to say, well, what if this is a sign for me to do something different? What if this set up? What if this setback 
to set me up for a comeback? What if this situation, this person that was in my life for 10 years and now they're being removed out of my life and maybe I feel pain, but maybe the universe says, if you want to go here, this person must go here. If you want to move here, then you can't stay there. If you want to drive this type of luxurious car where the car you have may be removed from you. Does that make sense? Guys, I don't want to, you know me, <laughs> you know, thanks for the likes and share, guys. Please share this video out or maybe don't share this video out, but I think somebody needs to hear this. Because, see, the powers of what if made me or is a piece of the puzzle that made me a multimillionaire. But what I'm telling you, that I'm still doing the same things I did when I had nothing. I come on here when I feel that I need to inspire or touch somebody's life to say, keep going. What if? What if it works out? What if you get the loan for the business? What if the next person that comes into your company is the person that changes your company? What if the next ideal you have is the product that's going to make you a millionaire? How do I know? I did it! I did it! Because everything that I did, every failure, every struggle, every crying night, I said, you know what? There is a indication this is an indicator to tell me that the next thing is the big thing that's gonna put me in a situation I am today and you see me winning baby you see me winning what I'm telling you use the powers of what if for your life I'm talking to you if you're watching me right now if you feel this share the video and say to yourself right now what if my current situation even though it doesn't look good you know what? This is the reason. What if it all works out? What if I wake up tomorrow and I have $100,000 in my bank account? What if I work What if I wake up tomorrow and I meet the business partner or or I get the ideal that's going to change my entire life? What if? See, you can play with this. It's like a game. I used to play with it. What if? Well, what if this works? Well, what if it works out? I want you tonight, right now, today, to stop using what if that's going to disempower you. Don't say, what if it don't work? Well, what if it don't work? Well, what if we have problems? Well, what if I, I do this and I lose the money? What if I waste my time? What if I go to, what if I do? That's fear. All I'm asking you is to use the word what if and use that power to set you up to put you on the other side of the spectrum, which is the 1% where I am, where many people are. It is time for you to move away from the 99% of people. You may love them. You may adore them. You may want them to be lifted up. But what I'm telling you from my heart, that based off your desire, God in the universe is going to challenge you. And a certain thing is going to happen to you in your life because, see, the universe or God wants to know if you really want the thing that you desire. It's going to be challenges. It's going to be things that you're going to have to perceive in a different way, not like the other 99%. You drop your cell phone, you break it. Oh, my God, I dropped my cell phone. Oh, my God, it's cracked. I just bought this cell phone. Who gives a f right? You have to tell yourself here today that you will no longer be like a 99%. Set yourself up like a king and a queen. Put your mindset in that situation now and everything outside of you will manifest effortlessly. Like it's doing for me. Hey, I love you guys. Thank you for sharing and liking this video. If it resonates with you in your life, Please share this video. I just ask you to add a love from my heart to share and like this video because me, Wesley Million Dollar Virgin, is here to make a contribution to people's lives, including yours, to let you know that you will win. You will win. And you are winning. But when you use the powers of what if, and you use that power and set yourself up in advance to win, you will win.
Hey, guys, go to westerlyvirgin.com. All my videos are there. They're on Facebook. They're on YouTube as well. Thank you for your love. That's in with. I'm a winner. Motivated. Dedicated. Motivated. Dedicated. Motivated. Dedicated. Motivated. Dedicated. I'm a winner. 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 Wesley, million dollar virgin. Much love. Love you guys. Later.